Safe and Sane Fireworks go on sale this weekend, kicking off a week of celebration for American independence. And experts expect it will be a busy year for vendors. 13 Action News reporter Sean Delancey is live at home to tell us why so many people will create their own light shows this year. Sean. Yeah, Alicia, it's going to be a really big year for at-home fireworks displays, mainly because of the coronavirus, keeping people away from crowds and canceling large displays. In fact, the American Pyrotechnics Association says that this will be a record year for at-home fireworks sales. An Orlando Health study found that two fifths of all Americans will buy their own fireworks with 16% naming coronavirus related show cancellations as the reason that has health officials worried that they will see an uptick in fireworks related injuries like serious burns, loss of fingers, or even blinding and death as untrained people handle their own explosives. Or orthopedic surgery resident Elizabeth Gibson says that all fireworks should be treated with respect. Even those people generally consider safer like sparklers. They can actually reach temperatures of up to 2,000 degrees, which is enough to melt metal and certainly can melt your clothing, your skin, any other tissue like that. Now, to stay as safe as possible, never hold a firework after it has been lit. Always keep a bucket of water and hose around. Do not drink alcohol. Don't allow kids to use fireworks without supervision. And be sure to soak your fireworks before throwing them out. Even after they've been fired, they can still smolder and cause a fire later. To protect yourself and others, be sure only to use the legal safe and sane fireworks. Anything that flies up in the air or explodes is likely illegal. Now, if you want to see one of these big shows so that you can sit back, relax, and leave all of this to the professional, there are still some going on in the Valley, and we have a full list over on our website, ktnb.com. Sean Delancey, 13 Action News.